Welcome to the Got Wood tutorial. This isn't a how to get wood on the first day tutorial. This is a I need a lot of wood for a big project tutorial. It's a lot easier than a tree farm and it's pretty simple. Assuming that you are established, you end up with a lot of bone meal. There's nothing to do with it, so this is a good way to do it. Basically, you can grow 20 trees really quick. Once it gets to this point, the pistons can no longer push the wood, so you cut it all down. I originally saw Etho make this in his LP world, but I don't think he ever made a tutorial on it, so I'll just make this quick tutorial because it's quite a simple build. You will need one redstone torch, two redstone repeaters, ten redstone, two glowstone, four cobble, five pistons, one block of glass. That's sort of the important part in a way. Anyway, where the sapling goes, once it grows into a tree, the redstone power can travel through the block, which will trigger all, trigger all the pistons. It's quite a simple setup. Now, currently, redstone can travel through the corners of glass blocks, so if that one day gets patched or changed, you'll just have to redesign this little system. Redstone power gets to all five pistons, which then push the tree to the side. I was saying that the glass block is important, and that glass block is placed eight, seven blocks of air, and then one block of glass. This prevents you from getting a ginormous tree, which will clog up the whole system and look ridiculous. I recommend you build a little hole to stand in while you're planting the saplings. That way you're not buried in leaves accidentally. This works for regular trees as well as birch trees. However, if you want the darker wood, you'll have to raise that glass block higher because the dark wood trees always grow a bit taller. And as far as giant jungle trees, well, this ain't going to work in that system, but it might work for single jungle trees. This is a little project that I built using a lot of wood. It took me a few days to collect everything, but I think it turned out alright. I hope this tutorial was easy enough to understand, and I hope it gives you a good idea on how to get a lot of wood quickly. I know I've used it many times in the past, and it's always handy to have the knowledge. Please thumbs up the video and subscribe. I'm always releasing videos. Talk to you later. Once I break this mine cart, it will trigger the redstone, which triggers the red TNT chain reaction. Let's see what happens.